everyone. Today we'll be talking about spiders. Take a few seconds to think of or write down the first three words that come to your mind when you think of a spider. The words that you came up with likely describe your first impression of spiders. A first impression is the feeling that we get when we first meet someone or something that we don't know a lot about. But when we begin to learn more, our first impressions can change. If the words that you use to describe spiders were negative words like scary or dangerous, that's okay. And in fact, many people feel this way. In this video, I hope to share a few facts with you that'll help you overcome your fear or change your mind about the way you feel about spiders. If you already think that spiders are cool, interesting creatures, then you can use the facts in this video to help share your opinion with others. If you're watching with a buddy, Feel free to pause this video after each fact and ask each other, does this new information support or challenge my first impression of spiders? Fact 1. Of the numerous types of spiders found in North Carolina, there are only two kinds of spiders whose bite could potentially be dangerous to humans. These spiders are the black widow and the brown recluse. Like snakes, spiders will not bite humans unless they feel threatened and have no way to escape. Encounters with dangerous spiders like the black widow and the brown recluse are rare. Other more common spiders that we'll see in our yards or near our homes are not harmful to humans. If you do see a black widow or a brown recluse near your home, there are many things that you can do to avoid being bitten. Leave the spider alone. Wear gloves when you're reaching into dark places. Shake off anything that you pull from the attic or the cellar. Empty out shoes that have been outside. Fact 2. Spiders help humans in many ways. Spiders help humans by eating insects like mosquitoes and gnats that can be harmful to us and our gardens. It is important to note that spiders are not insects. Spiders have eight legs and two body segments, while insects have six legs and three body segments. Spiders are also helping humans by giving scientists ideas to help improve some of our most important materials. Spider spit has been studied to help improve adhesives. Spider webs have been studied to help strengthen bulletproof materials like Kevlar. And we have even studied certain types of spiders to learn more about the key to living a longer life. Fact 3. Spiders first appeared on Earth 400 million years ago about 170 million years before the first dinosaurs. This means that spiders have been playing an important role in our ecosystems for a very, very long time. Imagine a world without spiders. Animals who depend on spiders for food would likely be negatively impacted, and insects whose populations are kept in check by spiders would increase, and that might cause harm to us and to our crops. And think about all of the discoveries that we would lose out on if scientists couldn't study spiders. Fact four. We share our home here in the Southern Appalachian Mountains with a very special spider called the spruce fir moss spider that is not found anywhere else in the world. This spider is special because it is the world's smallest tarantula. It can only be found in spruce fir forest habitats that occur on the tops of our highest mountains like Grandfather Mountain, Mount Mitchell, and Roan Mountain. And it is endangered. Due to threats of habitat loss from climate change and the loss of Fraser fir trees to the Balsamolia delgid, this little spider has fewer and fewer places to live. This is why the work of conservation organizations like the Southern Appalachian Highlands Conservancy is so important. By protecting the land and the habitats found there, we can also protect the rare high elevation species that live in those habitats. It is really important that we do all we can to protect endangered species like the spruce fir moss spider. Every time a species goes extinct, we lose the benefits that it provided to our ecosystem, and we also lose the benefits that it might have provided humans if we had the chance to study it. Okay, after learning that one, spiders are helpful and not harmful, two, spiders are important to our ecosystems, and three, that we have the chance to protect an endangered species, the spruce fir moss spider, that is only found here and nowhere else in the world, how do you feel about spiders now? Has your first impression changed? 
Hopefully, some of the words that you have used to describe spiders, like scary or dangerous, have now been replaced with words like interesting or important. Alright, now it's craft time. With this craft, you'll be able to weave your own web and make your own spider friend. Thank you all for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you next time.